feel like I'm a lot more confident about the strengths in my writing. Um, I feel like I've, I've got a very strong voice, I know how to do dialogue really well, but I also know how to identify my weaknesses and learn how um, to use those as, um, as strengths. You know, I, I have a lot of problems with including location, um, including the, the space that the characters are in, but now I'm starting to use that um, as an advantage and, you know, world building more. On the very first day, Richard Beard um, gave a, a talk on different ingredients in your story. So he talked about um, charging these ingredients with some kind of emotional content. Um, so, you know, having charged events and places and people, but also objects, which I'd never really considered. You know, having um, a, an object that's emotionally charged in a scene, for example, having a, a chair in the living room that by itself is not charged, but when you say that it is the father's chair and the son-in-law comes in and sits in that chair, it creates drama and it creates tension just based on this object. Um, and I think that that's been really useful for me as I go and, you know, uh, try and create stories that have that kind of tension. Um, Nicholas Hogg, um, who's my supervisor, has also given me a lot of good advice on using active verbs, um, trying to find the most specific verb and the most specific noun so that I don't have to use all this kind of superfluous language and just say what I need to say in, you know, one noun and one verb. So the supervision is a pretty unique, um, it's pretty unique to Cambridge um, as I understand it and it's, uh, the supervision is, you know, a very, very small group with um, one supervisor who will look over your work and acts as a mentor um, to your work and is very, very involved in what you do and the work of a few others. Um, so the way that it works in this program is um, every, you know, the day before our supervisions meet, um, everybody sends out um, the most recent chapter or the most recent um, story that we want to have everybody else read. So everybody will go through and we sort of edit it, we revise it, and then we bring it into the supervision and we discuss it as a group. The people that are involved here really truly want to help you. They want to help you move forward, they want your writing to improve. They're going to teach you the discipline of writing every day. Um, they're going to teach you how to improve your writing as you write it so you don't have to do as many edits. It's going to be well worth your while.